if by this stage of your life you're still struggling with public speaking you know that your communication skill isn't good at all and you feel embarrassed whenever you speak up in public i want you to watch this video to the end because in this video i will be sharing with you four things you could do to improve your public speaking okay so before i dive into the four tips on how you could go on to improve your pop um your communication skill i want you to ask yourself what is blocking me from talking what is blocking me from expressing myself to people what is, what is actually blocking me from socializing with others ask yourself these things i want you to then now do a self introspection on yourself okay think sit back and think and think about why you're not able to communicate well why are you shy to talk on camera and the things that are actually stopping you from communicating it's not as if you don't know what you want to say but whenever you try to say those things it feels as if something is actually blocking you um, from communicating the way you want so until you ask yourself these things you will not improve your communication skill okay so with that being said let's just dive right into the four tips i have for you one of the things i want you to recognize is that one you need to be intent if you actually want to improve your public speaking if you actually want to be good at communication you need to be determined you need to have the zest for it you need to you know fight for it you need to do the things that will lead to the cause yes you need to apply the action you need to step out you need to you know ask yourself why why do i want to be good at and um, public speaking why do i want to improve my communication what can i do to improve my communication skill what can i do to get better at communicate um, at public speaking and lastly how can i go about it how can you go about it until you ask yourself these three things your why your what and your how you you're just holding yourself back because these are the questions you need to ask yourself you need to be intent with whatever it is you want okay be it to keep fit or whatsoever but the main subject of this video is um communication and public speaking so ask yourself what you can do to improve your public speaking why you want to improve it and how you can go on to improve your public speaking because this we um this will give you a, a high sense of purpose and as well it will build intention so that you will be able to be disciplined and stick around and find reasons as to why you need to improve your communication skill and the second is you need to read books i know a lot of you will not like this but yes you need to read some self-help books read books on how you could go to as well improve your communication skills it could be novel anything or self-help book or motive or motivational books and all you know any kind of books just read these books i know it feels like um a difficult thing to do or it might take a whole lot of your time but it will not books will help you to you know build your vocabularies books will help to build new newer call um, new newer connection on your brain okay as you're reading this thing your hippocampus is learning as well all the neurons in your brain are firing up and they are you know grasping the things you're reading the information you're reading it might not show up immediately but with time you will begin to see the um result the improvement and the changes on the way you speak so read books do not neglect that read books okay because you need you need to you need to be you know cautious and self-aware if you want to improve your um, communication skill and as well your public speaking third on the list you need to be confident how do you expect to be confident without even believing in yourself how do you expect to speak well to become a better communicator yet you doubt your capabilities you doubt yourself to the extent that you even say that you're a terrible speaker that you sound off no you need to be optimistic you need to believe in yourself and love and embrace the way you talk because these things are the things that will give you a sense of purpose and a sense of you know and and a sense of assurance that yes you're doing great that you're doing a good job there isn't any um, good public speaker that doesn't believe in themselves so you need to believe in yourself and be confident with the way you sound despite all the mistakes you make okay yes we learn and go by the mistakes we make because they build us they teach us that yes they miss us a better strategy you know to restrategize on what we've done wrong and then have a better approach and and, and then correct them in the right way so be confident with the way you speak do not be afraid or do not you know feel um embarrassed with the way you sound okay be confident because what you actually think that people you know you thinking that people doesn't like the way you sound or people are you know 
are gonna make fun of you just because of the way you sound it's a lie nobody cares about the way you sound okay be confident with the way you sound and believe in yourself knowing that with time you will improve um, um your public speaking and as well your communication skill will you know up okay last but not the least which is the fourth one and i think is the most important is speak on camera yes i know a lot of you will find this one to be somehow somewhat difficult like if not 90 percent of you guys will not like this one but you need to speak on camera one of the things that has actually helped me to improve my public and my own communication skill is actually talking to you guys on here on, on youtube and as well on other platform that i have i mean other social media platform that i have until you recognize that yes this um and the so-called public speaking and as well communication isn't just limited to talking to yourself in your room or you know talking to a little people just the people that are too close to you you will not like you're not even building yourself in any way so speak on camera you could go on to record yourself and film yourself as you're talking that that we actually improve and um, that will actually build you and as well improve you in the long run because you will see how your facial expressions are and as well your hand gestures the way you're moving your hand as you talk and communicate to people okay speak on camera talking to folks on here on youtube has actually helped me a lot to you know become good and as well improve with my communication skills so speak on camera speaking on camera nobody cares about your flaws okay we are here to listen to your voice and your opinion about a particular topic we are here to listen to what you have to say we are not here to look at your mistakes or to judge you with the way your voice sounds we are actually here to listen to what you have to bring on the table the value that you're giving us that's what we are looking at not your flaws okay nobody will judge you with the way you sound okay no native speaker will actually um, listen to a non-native speaker and judge them by the way they sound just because they don't they they are not you know fluent or eloquent with the way their communication skill is so speak on camera and do not be ash and do not be shy of anything okay do not be afraid to speak do not be afraid or do not allow whatever it is that is holding you or limiting you to hold you back again okay speak 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 use your voice to speak on camera okay film yourself after recording yourself you could go on to see the way that you're doing things okay the ones you're doing wrong you could go on to as well improve them okay that is the stages of life that is how life operates you don't just get good at something overnight okay it all takes pressure and just know that with that patient all these things that i've just mentioned here is a waste of time because you cannot expect to get result or see your communication skill improve overnight without being patient with yourself you need to recognize that yes i'm becoming a, a good speaker or improving your communication skill takes time and effort so put effort practice 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 with time you will get used to it and you will become a good speaker okay it will have stunned you the result everything we have stunned you just embrace um your authenticity be authentic to yourself be real to yourself believe in yourself ask yourself why do you want to become a good speaker how can you improve it and what can you do each day to become better okay and be intent okay believe in yourself have a reason have a reason read good books read books that will motivate you books that you will learn one or two things from books will help you to feel life and world in a different way okay on a higher perspective it's you you get knowledge by reading you get knowledge by and new skills but and from the things you read okay not only on the things you watch so read books self-help books we go on to improve you and as well make you to build yourself to become the person that you want to be okay do not neglect any of these things do not ignore it okay even the little details because the little details do matter a lot pay close attention to the little details because those little details you might be ignoring is where most of the results are okay the results are significant because all great things comes from small beginning okay so try to improve yourself in some way okay do these things and you will see your public speaking and as well your communication skill improve overnight peace and do have a great day ciao